Hi guys! You're gonna love this house tour and we are so excited to feature this one because so far this is the team's favorite and if you're a big basketball fan, you're gonna love this one. So finish this up until the end and you're gonna find out more about the house and I know you guys are excited, so there! Good day everyone and welcome to another AB Properties house tour and today we're gonna take a look at this two-story house inside an exclusive village in Paranaque. Before we start, please click subscribe to AB Properties official YouTube channel and check us out on Facebook and on Instagram. It's at AB Properties underscore official for all of our fresh listings. My name is Apple Grace and I cannot wait to show you this one guys because you guys are going to love what's inside and if you find out who this house belongs to, you're going to be even more hyped. So let's go! Let's climb up the stairs leading up to our front porch but we're not gonna go in yet because I'll be showing you the outside of the house. Here we are, stepping on the paved pathway of our lush garden. So that's your front garden. And it goes all the way here to your side garden leading us to your extended porch i mean your extended lanai okay don't cut me on that one and of course we have our five feet deep swimming pool guys so again this is such a nice feature i mean nice feature because of the house's price the location and everything that's inside the house so you're gonna find out more about that. Follow me as I take you to the end of the pool. So we have another lounge area over here. And then on my left would be your shower area. So this is where you shower before you take a dip into the pool and after as well. And then you'll have a sneak peek of our utility area and the laundry area. So go check that out. The bamboo accent behind me, the ornamental plants all over the house, and the color of the walls by the swimming pool. This house really gives you that tropical vibe, which actually feels like you're on a vacation within the comforts of your own house. And here we are in our lanai. Wow, this is so nice. Loving all of the fixtures and the furniture used over here. So evidently, you can see the rattan materials and everything feels so organic here. And ang sarap ng feeling talaga pag nandito ka. I love the lanai area because you get to, you know, access the dining area and the living room area. But I'm gonna show you more of that one as we go inside the house. So now follow me. As we go back to the front area of the house, leading to the carport. So let's go. Okay, now let's beat the clock before the sky turns black. <laughs> Follow me over here. And welcome to your two car carport. And right above us would be our helper's room. And then I'll be showing you a peek of this access way over here. So this one leads us to our utility area and ki um, service kitchen rather follow me but before we go into it so this is where our um, this is our toilet and bath for our helpers so there you have it and welcome <laughs> to your restaurant grade service kitchen over here yeah tama naman sinabi ko diba this is Stainless steel material. I mean, you guys know what it is. You know how expensive this setup is. And then behind me would be the access to the laundry area and utility area. Yung pinakita ko sa inyo kanina, right beside the shower area after the pool. So just take a quick look. Boom. Finish. <laughs> 
Okay, so let's close this one. And the moment we've been waiting for, let's go back to the porch. Let's now check out the porch and the front door. So a gorgeous front door leaves you anticipating of how or what kind of interiors are inside. So I'm super excited to check out if it keeps up with this beautiful vision. Let's go. Wow. This feels so homey and cozy. And I gotta mention again, guys, I know you can see it from, well, evidently, it has a very industrial look, but still very rustic. Um, there's a good combination of the four elements or four colors. So we have wood, we have white, we have black, and cool gray. And I love this wall accent over here. So this is brick wall or brick wall design. So what they did is they installed this one because they don't want the wall to look flat and bare. So this is such a nice idea. And then as you can see, of course, the wood element up above will be consistent from the entire first floor and you're gonna love it so much. And then check out this access door right here or access to our lanai, extended lanai and the pool as mentioned earlier. And you gotta love the curtains, the furnitures used. So it's really pretty cool gray again. Goes well with the gray sofa and the black bigger sofa. So follow me. And this is also something that I really love about this house because the hallway is very, very spacious. I mean, if you have kids running around the house, so this would be the perfect spot for them. They won't be bumping into each other very often. And then the window with another view of our lanai and the pool. And then before we get into one of my favorite parts of the house, let's first check out the first bedroom on the first floor. Ta-da! <laughs> okay, this is everyone's favorite spot, especially the boys during the pandemic. But girls, hindi tayo magpapahuli. We love our kettlebells. So this is your home gym. Really nice, right? But if you get this house and buy this house, totally up to you how you want to, you know, utilize this. Could be an office, a guest room. And then, let's check out our powder room. Oopsie. Okay. Come on in, guys. Again, like what we always tell you whenever we show you the powder rooms of each houses that we visit, we like to, you know, put a bright light on how they become, I mean, how they make it really unique out of the other bedrooms or bathrooms of the house. So this one, it has a really nice cool gray um, tiles. And then we have our wooden vertical slats and loving the vanity mirror. It's black, so the industrial vibe is still here, alive. And our gray sink. So I think this is the first time that we've seen a gray, a cool gray sink, right? And then a floating vanity. Wow. Okay, so if you're a minimalist and you love the play of colors, then this is the house for you. Okay, I hope you love that part of the house, now I'm gonna take you to every woman, every girl's favorite part, the dining area. Wow, so this one is a solid slab of acacia wood. This seats or sits one, two, three, four, five, six, eight people. All in all, so if you're a big family or you like inviting friends over, yes, this is this is really nice. And gotta say Wow to this beautiful industrial drop pendant lights. Get that right? So I, I like every time you're here, you feel like you're having a light bulb moment. So if you're thinking about so many things, yeah, this is the spot for you. And then as promised earlier, I'll be showcasing this access door to our lanai, extended lanai, and to the pool area. Cool. And then one thing you'll notice, every part of the house, you see ornamental plants. They really bring life to the room. And before we miss, okay, while you're enjoying your dinner, 
you have a great view of your swimming pool. So there it is. It looks so blue and green at the same time from this view. So, you know, after dinner, if you feel bloated, go for a swim. Just, you know, jump right into it. Or jump right into it. There, nabulul pa tayo. Okay, so yep. So many things to love about the dining area. And this is also something that is really unique. So you have your vanity mirror over here, your console table that really goes well with the color of your Akasha dining table. And the black color is dominant and it really gives you that a little bit of a manly vibe, you know? And now, okay, follow me as I lead you to your show kitchen or the main kitchen of the house. Okay, gotta love this center island over here. And then underneath it, a lot of storage for you. So I think there's a wine rack as well, but we're gonna find that. And then on the other side. So what's nice about this, it's matte black. It's really classic. And you have your countertop, you have your range hood, and your modular kitchen cabinets. And what I like about this one is it doesn't have a handle anymore. So the design is very seamless. You won't see any bumps and other colors involved. So what you're gonna see in this kitchen, dominant black, white, and wood. So again, rustic and industrial at the same time. So even the, the appliances they use is also black. And check out this anthracite double sink and your faucet in black as well. And then you have a window right in front for ventilation when you're cooking something aromatic. And onto this side would be one of the fun parts if you love, you know, making your coffee over here in the morning or in the afternoon when you feel sleepy. And then guys, I, I think you're gonna love this one so much because the house is fully furnished. So everything stays in the house, including this double door refrigerator. But I'm not gonna show you what's inside. It's for my eyes only, but yeah. Nice, right? Oh, before we miss it, we have our bar stools underneath our counter island. So this is perfect place for you to have that conversation with your parents, with your siblings, and then underneath this beautiful industrial drop lighting as well. Good there, right? And let me just show you Okay, right behind our videographer is this access door right here. So this door is actually gonna lead us to our service kitchen. There you have it. So na pakita na namin yun sa inyo kanina. Are you guys excited to go to the second floor? Because we are done with the entire first floor. And now, before we check out the second floor and the bedrooms, let's just take a moment to check out this highlighted picture wall. So again, you can see, right? This framed game-worn championship jerseys. Wow! I think you guys have an idea who this house belongs to. So let us know if you a big fan of Never Say Die. And let us know in the comment section since when. Okay, we want to know how many years you Joke lang. We just want to know how big of a fan you are. Yung tipong, wow, last two minutes, Never Say Die pa rin. Ayan, number six. And all of his jerseys are all here, so wow. Okay, so guys, ang ganda, right? So let us know in the comment section how big of a Hinebra fan are you? And who is your favorite player? Huwag ka magkakamali. <laughs> okay, so... We are here at the second floor landing area. So this is the house's second living room or family area. Perfect, right? We have, or you have your entertainment um, appliances right in front of you, your television, you have your sound bar and everything. All of the trophies of our, one of our favorite Hinebra San Miguel player, of course. And you're gonna love also the 
elements used in this landing area because it's still consistent with what we saw from the first floor. So you have your cool gray accent, your wood accent, your white walls, right? I hope you guys love it. And never forgetting about the industrial drop pendant lighting right over there. And syempre, hindi natin pwedeng kalimutan ang ating mga plants. So we are surrounded with a lot of ornamental plants inside the house. And now we're gonna check out the first bedroom on the second floor. Let's go! Here we are on the first bedroom. So this is a regular size bedroom, but it feels really spacious. I think because of the play of color, there's not a lot of like chaos in your vision. You have your white walls, you have, you know, this gray, white, Korean um, cover. What do you call that one? <laughs> and then this is your sliding um, built-in closet. You have your bedroom. This would be your study table. And let's check out your toilet and bathroom suite. So here we are. Hi guys, still there. Okay, you have your shower area right here and your shampoo niche. Water closet, floating sink, your vanity, handler, single sink it is for the single buddy that you are. Okay, now done with the first bedroom, check out the second bedroom on the second floor. Let's see if it's the same. I think it's equally the same size. So here we are, you have your ACs with you, your bed, and then right in front would be your, what do you call this, like your entertainment part of the house where you could put your television. So you could have it wall mounted. No, much better. Saves you space. You can use up the space below it. And then you have more shelves. Let's check out your toilet and bath. So it's pretty much the same. Consistent with the colors that is, you know, available on the first uh, bedroom toilet and bath. So here we are. Nantago lang natin yung towel natin. But that's fine. Then we're done with the second bedroom. And now guys, I think, well, the guys, the men of the house are gonna be wanting to take this bedroom or room over here. But I think if this is my house, I ain't that joke lang. Not my house, but yeah, welcome to your man cave. I love the color combination. This is such a guy's dream man cave. So it's totally up to you if how you want to decide uh, design it when you get this house. So you have again our prize and our highlight, our you know game worn jerseys, Hinebra number six, everyone. <laughs> and there you have it, more of him. Hi sir, idol kita. <laughs> and then we have our matte black storage area for all of your shoes, your stuff, and whatnot. And let's check out your toilet and bath ensuite. So again, it remains very consistent with the house's entire, or each bedroom's toilet and bath. So here we are, minimalist. Right. And now we're gonna check out everyone's favorite part of the house, or the bedrooms. Guys, let's check out the master bedroom. So this one is equipped with a smart lock. Let me be the first to see it. Okay, come on in and follow me. Yes. Wow. So now this is your master bedroom. So you have your bed right in this spot. And then you have your, this would be your like a wardrobe or your closet. So the reason why they keep that open without the, you know, the sliding doors and the closing doors is the owner wanted, like he wants to see everything. And I think he's a little bit lazy when it comes to closing his cabinets after he gets dressed up. So yeah, that's the purpose of it. 
And here we are on the other side of the master bedroom. So it's really spacious and you get, so this mirror right here stays with the house. So nice for those mirror selfies. And then right in front, your bedroom, of course, the usual thing that you're gonna find is your television set. And guys, I think I'm gonna love this one. So contrast from the color in the master bedroom, I think you're when you get inside our master toilet and bath and walk-in closet, you're, you're gonna think that you're in a different room because this is just so immaculately white. The color combination in this master toilet and bath and master walk-in closet is immaculate and heavenly white with a gold accent. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So nice. Wow, you're gonna love this one, ladies, I swear. This master walk-in closet is made for you. And then you have your vanity mirror over here with how many bulbs? <laughs> okay, perfect when you're taking your selfies and mirror selfies. So come on in and check out the master toilet and bath. If you're very OC, I think this is the perfect color palette for you because you're gonna see every little, like, you know, a dot of dirt. You're gonna see it. So here we are. And then let me just go inside our glass enclosed shower area and again, gold plated or gold accent up until the stuff where you hang your towels. And then this one is a frosted glass to keep the moist in when you shower. Okay, let's keep that one open and then follow me again. And this life-size mirror. Is it hiding something? Okay. All right, so come on in. I mean, come out. Whew, so we are done with the master bedroom. Now guys, follow me downstairs. I hope you love the entire tour of the second floor. So come on and follow me. And that concludes our house tour for today. Thank you so much, guys, for staying with us up until the end. Let us know on the comment sections below what you think about the house and which part is your favorite. And before I let you go, please don't forget to click subscribe to AV Properties' official YouTube channel and check us out on Facebook and on Instagram. It's at AV Properties underscore official for all of our fresh listings. And if you want to list your properties with us, all you have to do is message us or email us at avproperties.com official at gmail.com my name is apple grace and thank you so much for staying with us guys see you on the next house tours <laughs>